In this video, I will show how to create a simple map in Context Mines from scratch. Then I'll be talking about some key features in Context Mines. To be honest, I've prepared a couple of maps about this topic and related content in advance, therefore I'll be using personal suggestions a lot. Then I will show you how to create an article covering all topics you have related to in your map and at the end we will export the map with your own company logo. We will start with this green button, new map. We will name the map. I'll keep it simple and call it Context Mines. Here I keep it private and I will start from scratch or I can choose from one of these templates. Uh, we have a blanket work workspace so we can start adding first concepts. I see there is Context Mines. To keep it well arranged, I will add a picture. I have downloaded this to my workspace in my computer. Okay. Now we can go on and uh, go through these related concepts. We can use the funnel filter to choose the sources or we can Click on topics, keyword questions, etc. and switch on and off this chat GPT button. We have one of the first questions here, so I can add it to my map and connect it to the main concept. What is context mines and how it how does it work? I I can start adding some more concepts to create my map. It's personal ideas library. It's information research could be also useful. Information AI text generator. This is very important. I will be talking about it later. I would add this one and I explain it. It AI text generator. It's a generator that has AI powered algorithm and it goes through a vast amount of data and uh, delivers accurate and reliable results according to the customer needs. So we have it here as well. Uh, I would also add time efficiency because information research takes a lot of time and context mines it detects biases filters out irrelevant content and verifies sources i will link it this and have a look what we have here another important part of mapping is keyword mapping. It's really crucial to create a content and to get targeted content uh, that suits to the audience. What is keyword mapping? We can add some more co concepts to get detailed information. We can load more to have a look. What is keyword mapping? Keyword URL mapping. You can see that there are suggestions. Keyword mapping is the process assigning keywords to different pages within your websites. Yeah, this is very accurate. I can copy it, pin it to notes, and to get it, get to it back later. Uh, we can add also how to do keyword mapping to have practical examples. I'll link it to have it like this. You can see that in related concepts we have already some hints. 
identify your keywords map your keywords and group your keywords if you're not sure how to do this you can also click on it and show suggestions or you can go through questions with ChatGPT on and there will, there will appear a lot more questions to this topic. I keep this switched off and continue with adding more concepts. Yeah, we have covered keyword mapping, information research, and now I would like to talk about the third, the most important part of content creating creating and this is content marketing content marketing is the main reason why we are working on this map context minds helps with content marketing What is content marketing? We can add some more topics. And we can also have a look if there are any maps already existing about this topic. You can see there is one map. This is the direct link to it. If I click on it, I can go through it and save a copy or share it or anything else. And uh, or I can insert it to my map like this I will arrange the boxes and here we are we have created a simple map about context mines content marketing and other topics now we can create a final article about all these topics using this handy AI generator. It's being drafted, it takes sometimes about 5 to 10 seconds. As you can see, it is structured, easy to read, with some practical examples. We can save a copy to amend it according to our needs or we can drag it to map drag it to map or share it or anything else okay now we can finally export the map to pdf format i have added my own logo but we can add anything else we like and press PDF export. So that's it. Thank you for watching and see you at the next one. Bye.